Question 4. C is the point, and then we can see they give us the x coordinate and the y coordinate is left out. So let's just go and see where is C on our graph. There we go. We learned that B and C are points of intersection. So there is C. C is on the graph of G as well as on the graph of F. That means that we can either use the function formula for f and substitute the x that we are given or we can use the function formula for g and substitute the x that we were given there. So I think g is going to be much easier so negative 2 is given and we have that c is a point on uh, g so we can write it c is a point on G. So we have the G of negative 2 is equal to negative 16 divided by negative 2 and that gives me an answer of positive 8 which tells me that C is the point negative 2 comma 8. We'll type it in negative 2 and 8.